Schneider Electric launches a smart home ecosystem, Schneider Home, which looks to be one of the most complete smart home energy management systems to date. At the recent Consumer Electronics Show, CES, Schneider Electrical debuted its complete smart home energy ecosystem and was awarded at CES 2023 an innovation award for their app that brings all of this together. The Schneider Home will be unlike any other smart home system on the market, made up of five new products, the Schneider Pulse, the Schneider Boost, the Schneider Inverter, the Schneider Charger, and the Schneider Home App. They probably didn't need to throw their name in every single component. That's kind of annoying. Uh, this is something I've been waiting to talk about for well over a year, but I had no idea the extent of the product lineup. While there are still lots of details to be released, I wanted to get a video out there to get you excited about this and learn how significant this really is because there's one particular product that really stands out. But before I wow you about the future of home energy management, because I know you're excited, please take a second to subscribe to our channel by clicking that big red button down below. Yeah, just go ahead, click on it right down there. You're not going to want to miss out on the amazing products coming out later this year for solar and battery storage. As I had mentioned, the Schneider Home Energy Management Solution is made up of five components, each with their own purpose. And while there isn't a lot of details on each product, there is enough for me to talk about their significance, and I have a pretty good idea on how it's all going to work. Starting with the Schneider Pulse. This is something the solar and battery industry has desperately needed. And while some companies have tried to develop a fully integrated smart electrical panel, they've fallen pretty short. Now the Schneider Pulse, to my knowledge, is the first and only all-in-one smart electrical panel. And what I mean by all-in-one is that it's the utility meter and the electrical loads all in one box, yeah. Now, depending on where you live, this may seem fairly foreign to you, but for us here in California, this is the norm. All our loads and our meter are in one electrical box. The Schneider Pulse is intended for existing homes in need of an electrical panel upgrade. And this is something pretty common for us and our customers that are going solar or getting battery backup. Now, at first glance, it may not be as obvious to what the significance is of this panel. So let me break it down. First off, you can install smart circuit breakers as needed for individual breaker monitoring and control. This is very valuable during a power outage when you have a battery backup system, which leads us to the split bus bar design. As you can see, there's a top section and a bottom section to this electrical panel. While I don't have the full details on the Pulse's split design, it looks pretty clear to me it has three configurations available depending on how much you want to or can back up because every system has different limitations. The lower third section is likely for small backup with the top two thirds for medium. And if it's anything like the Schneider Energy Center, which we've done a video on previously, you can probably configure it for both top and bottom sections to be backed up for whole home backup. Now, there's one more feature built into the Pulse electrical panel, and that's an automatic transfer switch. Sadly, I have no information on this, and it actually came as a surprise to learn about. I had no idea they were working on something like that. My best guess is this will only be compatible with the Schneider Boost battery and hybrid inverter, which I don't think anyone will be disappointed about if you're truly able to eliminate all the extra components typically needed for solar and battery backup. Now, take a look at some of these recent projects we installed. This is very clean installation. I mean, you can't get much cleaner than this, but as you can see, over five feet of the wall space is the solar and battery backup equipment without even taking into account the batteries themselves, which took up the rest of the garage wall in some situations. 
Basically, the Schneider Pulse eliminates almost everything right here on the wall and integrates it into a single enclosure. So no emergency subpanel, no external automatic transfer switch, no gutter box, no five, six, eight feet of wall space lost. And if their battery is anything like they're alluding to in terms of size, storage capacity, and power output, then Enphase, Tesla, and SolarEdge have their work cut out if they're going to stay top dogs. At this time, I don't know enough about the Schneider hybrid inverter or boost battery to compare it to Enphase, Tesla, or SolarEdge. But I have to assume it is going to be pretty good because Schneider has been manufacturing and developing advanced electrical technology for decades longer than these guys. And this isn't their first rodeo when it comes to solar or battery inverters, but it will actually be what I consider their first mainstream product. As their previous models were used more or less for off-grid DIY types of projects or for large manufacturing companies or just companies in general that were white labeling the products and bundling it and, and creating an, an entire package based upon whatever Schneider had available for this situation of solar and battery backup. Though, in my opinion, they were pretty hokey pokey. We didn't really mess with them. Regardless, this is all very significant because it's a huge leap forward in the solar and battery sector. If their new electrical panel is universal and not tied to only their solar battery equipment, you can bet your butt it's going to be selling like New York cheesecake. I know we'll be offering it as soon as we have the pricing, even if it's only tied to their inverter and battery combination. But I need to know the availability. I got to know the details. If it's not a good product, obviously I don't want to offer it to my customers. And I'll probably be doing a follow-up video. So be sure to you know, subscribe to the channel because if it is a good product, we're going to compare it against Enphase and we're going to compare it against Tesla. You guys love those videos and I'm going to keep comparing them. So be sure to click that red button down below. Of course, if you're someone that's interested in going solar, please be sure to visit us online to receive your hassle-free quote. We make the process of going solar easy and affordable by handling everything in-house from plan design to installation. We're literally your one-stop shop home energy specialist. Now, Schneider released a couple extra products. The Schneider Charger, that's an electrical EV charger, electric vehicle level two charger, you know, nothing special there. And then the Schneider Home Energy app. They're basically just trying to create a nice ecosystem for your home so you can manage your loads, what you're using, you can monitor everything, you can do smart circuit control during power outages. Obviously, there's still a lot of questions on how it's all going to work together on universal systems, if they allow for, if it will be compatible with other battery backup products or if it's gonna be tied down. So hopefully we don't see that um, and we hopefully see, you know, companies like Enphase and SolarEdge and Tesla integrate with Schneider Pulse's automatic transfer switch, but you know, time will tell. So regardless, if you're interested in going solar, now's the time to do it. Use that link down below. That's kind of all I got for this week's video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.